Guy, I don't already tell you, say David do not the good. David do not the good. Do you even listen to whiskey soon? Which songs? Which songs your guys they give us? His tune is different. It's on another level. It's on anybody's level, guy. I never they follow you argue. Machala na your goat. Messi na your goat. You know Sabi boy. No, don't even add me. Don't don't add Messi to this thing. Don't add Messi. You know the boy. You know the boy. You want to be comparing Ronaldo and Messi? I mean, yo, who get a word pass? She will not wait on finish. Okay, guys, can I have a minute? This video is sponsored by Tifede Soe. So, statistics have shown that only 60% of people that are subscribed to my channel are watching my video. 40% are nowhere to be found. 30 to 40% of the people watching my videos are not subscribed. Now, I'm asking myself the question why? 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 Why are you not subscribed? Subscription is free, first of all. Subscription is free. And a lot of work go into making this video. I think I have proved myself. Have I not? Please subscribe and watch my videos. If you are watching and you are not subscribed, please subscribe. If you are subscribed, please come back and watch. I promise you watch your time. Thank you. So it is a beautiful day. I am scrolling through Twitter. And then I see a tweet. The initial tweet was um, a sarcastic tweet. The person was telling us to pick podcast over music and you know that's rubbish music over podcast all that anyways in the comments somebody said something like when we are talking about podcast we mean inspirational podcast podcast that you listen to early in the morning and you feel like your life has changed not i said what i said the person said that i said what i said now my question is what is wrong with i said what i said ah a lot is wrong with i said what i said a lot is wrong I said what I said is a podcast show that is hosted by FK Abudu and Jola. It is a podcast where they talk about a lot of things, issues resonating, humans, a lot of real life issues, comedy, banter, and all that. There's a whole lot to take away from the podcast. What he was actually trying to say was that pick those banter and I said what I said type of podcast are a waste of time and you should only invest your time in deep shit. I think it's okay to invest your time in deep shit. I also think it's okay for you to invest your time in I said what I said. Okay, let me hold on that for a little bit. I love Koti. She's my goat. I'm a Koti stan. So one day I was scrolling through her timeline or a tweet and then I saw one, one tweet somebody saying that I so much love that your videos are not a money routine type of video. Mind you, I have other YouTubers that I love that create money routine type of video so again what is wrong with money routine type of videos don't you watch Cotty's video Cotty's Cotty's videos they are chilled they are relaxed it's, you feel a kind of peace a kind of chilled vibe when you're watching a video complete juniors you you go finish you go watch a video finish and you go go think about your life so which are they do with my life how, how i will plan my life for well, those are the type of videos videos that make you reason your life guy they watch money routine how to label she knows how to label it me it's not about knowing how to label or not do you know there are some fabrics that you're not supposed to use to lay your bed some of them help you sleep better than some when we watch those videos we take those things away from it you know those money routine video now somebody start their day by laying their bed praying listening to a podcast i add it to my own daily daily routine and then my life get better like that's what i take away from that video tell me why i should not watch them whatever i have wasted my time watching that shit okay guys i think they get it thank you my point is that we are different people we are different humans we dif we consume a lot of different things content creators are different too we con consume and create a lot of different contents we cannot be the same there does not have to be a spectrum there's no right or wrong there's no cool and no cool you don't need to agree with somebody's preference their preferences are their personal choices and you don't need to agree with it just let them be you also don't need to make somebody feel like an outcast or uncool or meet because of their preference is different from your own i think that many of these different things that we consume add to us as human beings comedy rants talk banter are a part of us motivation inspiration are a part of us sometimes you need to consume things that make you think about your life that make you plan your life sometimes you need to consume things that are just relaxing there does not have to be a purpose there does not have to be anything serious behind it we listen to different type of music fine you watch korean movies i watch anime does not make me the cool one and you the uncool one vice versa people enjoy things for different reasons people consume things for different reasons 
people are different our personalities are different therefore our preferences will be different my preference is my choice your preference is your choice also when we start to talk about things like sex relationship and all those stuff many people tend to get judgmental and dismissive like these topics are not meant to be discussed in public or even discuss that talk we start telling people to focus on talking about only things like career growth financial security forgetting that every and different parts of these things act to us as humans and none should be left out it's very important to take things from different places it's very important to be diverse it's very important to not center yourself around one person or one thing because somebody else has a different opinion but a different taste or a different preference from yours does not make them uncool or an outcast or dull even when it comes to things like fun the definition of fun should be your definition don't allow other people's opinion to define it for you the definition of fun or what you see as fun is cool I think it's important to respect people's preferences. Let people enjoy what they want to enjoy.